As a heat wave continues to sweep through Europe, water levels of Rome's historic river Tiber have gotten so low that the remains of a bridge built under ancient Roman Emperor Nero have now become visible. Take a look. The river Tiber is a historic river of Europe and the second longest Italian river after the Po. The 252-mile-long river rises on the slopes. It flows through the city of Rome and enters the Tyrrhenian Sea of the Mediterranean. With record high temperatures in Europe, water levels of rivers have been decreasing. This has affected the Tiber as well. I am a little worried. Yes, it is obvious that water is now precious and we can't waste it. But when it is hot, it is very hard to not use water. So we have to try and battle it as much as we can. The lack of rain has resulted in the water level of the Tiber River dropping by almost six centimeters. The levels of the river have gotten so low that the remains of a bridge built under ancient Roman Emperor Nero is now visible. Emperor Nero was the fifth Roman emperor. He was infamous for his extravagant attitude and was the final emperor of the Julio-Claudian dynasty. The bridge takes its name from the Emperor Nero, who restructured it to improve the connections with his properties on the right bank of the river. The bridge is located in central Rome, opposite the Vatican. Usually, the remains are covered beneath the river, but now the remains can be seen clearly. Due to harsh summer, which is causing a drought, northern Italian regions risk losing up to half their agricultural output due to a drought as lakes and rivers start to run dangerously low, threatening irrigation and worrying locals. In Rome, tourists are battling the heat with makeshift funds and cooling off with the many fountains dotted all over the city. Temperatures between 40 to 43 degrees Celsius have been common from Spain to Germany. A new heat surge is expected in Central and Eastern Europe later this week. Bureau Report, We On, World is One. We On, World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.